Basically on the intersection of Santa Monica Duhini on the edge of Beverly Hills, so 468 North Duhini. The name of the show is Born for This. I am born rich to artists, and I'm just letting the world know I was born for this shit. You know, this is this is me. This is what I do. I paint, I draw, I make art, I make experiences. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate you. I see. You too, brother. Um, so yeah, just the cohesiveness. I had a, a thought in my head how I wanted to set up the exhibit and how I want to look in this rectangular space of a room. So I kind of wanted it to, to be symmetrical and then I wanted the punching bags to be down the middle so people can either walk through, swerve, go around them. But uh, the punching bags are an interactive piece. So you can look, you can walk around. Usually you can't touch art, but with these you can actually touch them, you can feel them, and you can uh, you know interact with them. I was doing video game production for a long time and I was getting burnt out, you know what I'm saying? I was working for NBA 2K, shout out to them, they're good people, but I was just getting burnt out, so I was like, you know, I need to get back to the essence of me. The essence of me was video games, comic books, cartoons, hip hop, basketball, skateboarding, all this shit, so it's like typography. So all this shit kind of merged into one, you know what I'm saying? It's like, at first I was taking my artwork too seriously, trying to do these stuffy portraits and stuff, so it wasn't working for me. And then once I start really getting into my niche and what I do best, that's when my work started. Oh, I've been following Ty with 10 years now. What you see every day and then you incorporate that into your art, it's like it's a, like a natural transition. Yeah. I'm all about colors and style, mm -hmm. right? So my art, for me, that I buy personally, is what will fit into my personal space. But there's also like an art in the way you dress, your style, right? Right? Mm -hmm. That's what I mean. So I know what I like. Nice. And I love, like, so people... This is story. People like Born Rich. Yes, the yes. stories are so super important. I'm a, a black guy, so uh, I'm a Jew of color, you know? So primarily I like to throw maybe a verse or two or something in my pieces, or I might say, you know, Moses versus Pharaoh, or I might just throw something in there just to give people like a snippet, you know what I'm saying? I got a new Kobe piece, and I put, you know, in Hebrew, five, Hamesh. Hamesh means five, so he won five rings. So it's like, you know, I just throw stuff in there, you know, little stuff like that, just throw little hints, little breadcrumbs, just to know, uh, just let people know where I come from. Man, the last thing, where are we at? Like, how long does the show go, you know what I'm saying? And how can they reach you? Yeah, uh, we're on Santa Monica and Duhini. This is 468 North Duhini. I'll be here for like two and a half weeks to the end of May. So to May 31st, I'll be showing my work. You can uh, hit me up on Instagram, Born Rich on Instagram. Uh, you can hit me on uh, like a Gmail, bornrichart at gmail.com. You can email me there. You can hit me anywhere. I got a website, bornrich.com. Check it out. Holler at your boy. Hey, follow me. Let's, let's go. go. Let's go. Let's go.
show all together. It's very cohesive. What's that on your hat? Size with everything, the colors, the stories. What's on the hat is MTLE, more talent, less ego. It's the family, it's the state of mind. It's the collective gallery and studio. Classic. Classic. Oh, this is hard, Martin.